when your pancreas detects a high level of blood insulin, it immediately secretes lots of insulin to bring that blood sugar back down to the normal level because having high blood sugar is dangerous. It's bad for your body and your pancreas knows this. So it secretes insulin to pull your blood sugar back down. But if you're eating basically six high carb meals a day, then you're spiking your blood sugar multiple times a day and that's keeping your insulin level chronically high. Now there may very well be a genetic, a little 1% genetic problem with some of the smooth mus muscle cells in your uterine wall. But that's not what causes fibroids. What causes fibroids is the chronic hyperinsulinemia that basically turns on the genetic trigger in these cells and makes them start to grow. A fibroid in your uterine wall is just a conglomeration of poorly formed muscle cells. That's what it is. And that's why it's never dangerous, but it can cause some rather concerning symptoms. It's highly likely that eating a low carbohydrate diet, like a ketogenic diet or a carnivore diet, is going to slowly shrink your fibroids over the coming months. So they're not gonna go away overnight. It's gonna take a few months to help shrink those fibroids. So especially if you've already been to your doctor with symptoms and you've been diagnosed with a fibroid or, or two or three, try a 90 day trial of a low carbohydrate diet, like a ketogenic diet or a carnivore diet. I predict that in three months time, your symptoms will get better. And the reason your symptoms are getting better is because the uterine fibroids are shrinking because they don't have that constant signal from insulin, hey, you need to grow, hey, you need to get bigger. Because insulin is definitely has many growth hormone-like characteristics, especially with smooth muscle cells that have a tiny genetic defect in them. Annotated and summarized. Easy to share with loved ones. The description below the title for this video has these summary points.